So I selected this photo because I have a really, really strong hunch based on pictures that I've seen my entire life that the woman in this picture is my grandmother and the man in this picture is my great uncle. Um, and looking at this picture just got me inspired and in thinking about um, my family's history with Milwaukee. And that story goes back to 1965. Um, when my grandmother, great-grandmother moved from Arkansas to Chicago and fell in love with a man who coincidentally was born in her exact state and city. They got married, gave birth to two children, and decided to give their children a better life in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Um, so in 1965, uh, there was, it was a pretty segregated city and there wasn't a lot of access for people of color to move in different parts of Milwaukee. So my great-grandmother and great-grandfather participated um, in the fair housing marches um, and were years later able to purchase a home by one of the friends that they met during the rallies. Um, this woman just so happened to have the same name as my great-grandmother. Her name was Marion Nelson. Um, and she went to lunch to meet Marion Nelson years later. Um, and they were at Marion Nelson's house and she said, you have a lovely home, Marion Nelson. Um, and she said, really? I'll sell it to you for a penny. <laughs> and my grandmother pulled a penny out of her wallet, handed the penny over to her name, the woman that shared her name, and this home was the home that I grew up in, and my mother grew up in, and my grandmother grew up in. Um, this home housed six generations because my great-grandmother was able to uh, provide shelter for her mother and her grandmother in this house. Um, and all my life we were told stories about <laughs> the crazy instances that led up to the moment where this house was bought for a penny. And the reason why the woman bought the house, sold the house for so cheap, was because there was an alleged ghost in the house <laughs> that was driving everybody crazy and she was just trying to break away. Um, so the house is on 18th and Walnut and um, it, has, it was one of the first houses in the neighborhood and that's where I call home, nice. so yeah.